Well, let's take you to Vale Park, shall we? Two sides just outside the top six up against each other here is Paolo Di Canio Swindon, who showed their credentials by winning 2 0 to move up to fifth. Swindon took the lead when Lucas Maguera scored from the edge of the area. Swindon were awarded a penalty when the referee ruled Adam Yates fouled Maguera. Mehdi Karouche took the kick, scored Swindon's second. That's the 50th goal at Vale Park in the last 11 matches. Port Vale manager Mickey Adams says some of his players have suffered a dip in confidence and Swindon exploited their frailty. Lucas Maguire establishing a half-time lead for Paolo Di Canio's side. We have no problems with team spirit anymore. They were on course for a fourth win in five. Chances were few and far between for the home club. Mark Richards creating one of the best for Tom Pope, who did well to find the space to shoot. But Swindon were home and dry early in the second half. Adam Yates leaning on Magira for leverage, putting Mehdi Karouche on the spot. The Algerians' penalty was inch perfect, helping Swindon move up a place to sixth. Swindon moved into the playoff spots as a fifth consecutive clean sheet set the platform for victory at Port Vale. Czech striker Lucas Maguera scored the first and a penalty from Mady Karouche sealed three points. Following close on their heels are Swindon in sixth spot. Lucas Maguera opened the scoring before Mehdi Karouche added a second with this penalty.